What's up guys, Luke Spin 69 here and we're gonna go on a ride on my 1979 Gorelli Rally Sport moped that I converted to a cafe yes, racer. So this is my uh, 1979 Gorelli Rally Sport moped. I bought it originally and uh, I'll, I'll show a picture right here of what it looked like. It was stock, uh, looked kind of pretty funky. And um, so I converted it over uh, for a school project this year. And uh, looks pretty sweet now. Did like the black and white color scheme. Um, since it is a moped, you know, it's only 50 cc's. What the heck? All right. Uh, my helmet isn't on all the way. There we go. So since it is a moped, it is 50 cc's, but it still is fun to ride. The only problem is like going up hills and stuff. That's why you just gotta be a little conscious to plan your route. Of course, I'd, I'd love to be on a, a big bike, but you know, it's only, the only thing that parents have permit. I always get interesting looks riding this thing. I think it's because I'm, you know, six feet tall on this little bike. So basically the process of converting it to a cafe racer was, um, you know, so I got it, stripped it down, uh, and I took it over to this moped shop, like, one of, like, very few in Austin uh, to get the top tank done on it, because originally the tank was on the down tube. Um, and so after that, after they got the top tank on, I um, started sanding everything down, putting the seat together, painting it, and then just putting everything back together. Uh, so yeah. Another thing about mopeds, you gotta worry about it. They are only 50 cc's. They only top out at about 30. There's some 70 cc kits though. That you can get you up to like 65, I think. It's around Honda Groms. We'll see how fast we can get. I think my speedo's a little messed up. Uh, my friend wrecked it like two weeks ago and so I had to fix that. And it seems to be working being a little funny, but it says we're going almost 40, like 30, 38, 37. Um, I mean, I'd be pretty surprised. Speedos on these things don't always work too well, but hey still fun. Maybe I need to get a little bit more aerodynamic. Yeah, it's bouncing all over the place. Definitely messed up. I'm flooring it right now. This is all it's got. Whenever I'm riding this thing, I feel like you need a whip. Get it going faster. It's funny to think about, my weed eater is like 25, 30 cc's. It's like, <laughs> this is 20 cc's more than my weed eater. Pretty funny. It's not too busy today. Surprisingly enough. What you looking at? We've got a badass over here. Oh, hills. One downside of mopeds, it's basically just hills. I let my friend ride my moped the other day, and this was right after I finished it. Oh, this is fun, here we go. Gotta watch out for bumps on this thing for sure. Um, so it was right after I finished it, and so I let him ride it. And the, the throttle on this thing doesn't spring back. It like came from the factory that way for some reason. Like, it's got, like I got cruise control. It just stays uh, stays forward if you floor it. And so, she was riding it and it was right after I finished it and the brakes were st still not in the best condition from putting it back together. So she rode it down a hill and was flooring it. <laughs> and I just, I looked down the street and I saw her put down her feet. And it was still like, like, wee, like, wee, like, wee, like, and, and then I just heard, boom, and I was like, that did not just happen. 
I was like, there's no way. And I was like thinking about, I was like going to walk down and I was like, no, 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 that didn't happen. There's no way. And I walked down there and sure enough, sure enough, it was on the ground. She was only going probably like, you know, 20, maybe, I don't know, not, it, wasn't, it wasn't too fast, otherwise she probably would have gotten pretty hurt. Interesting, since I had to fix it from the wreck, the what happened was the, the forks were bent and then this tire, or the wheel was just completely mangled, and so the new wheel's got a bigger drum. Uh, nice thing about the cafe racer build is that it feels faster. Even though, who knows if it is. Need some moped shirts that just say full throttle 24-7. Oh, so if you're 15 and you want to get a motorcycle and your parents don't let you, well, unless you get a real, mo like a full bike, I definitely recommend trying to get a moped. There, there are tons of fun, at first at least. You get a, a bit tired of it at the end because of, for example, this. They just do not like hills. If you want to get a moped though, it's nice because you don't have to get your full motorcycle license. Oh, stop sign. In Texas, at least, it's nice because if it's under 50 cc's and it doesn't have a manual transmission, all you have to do is um, take a course and then go to the DPS and take a written test. But to get your full license at 15, you have to take a, a driving test. I, I myself have not gotten my uh, full license yet. I hope to go do that really soon. I Tires are pretty small on this thing, so you gotta be a little careful. Because of this thing. Screw this. I am not doing that. Alright, wheelie time. Right at the end. Hope you guys like this video. See you later. Squash it. It's your mouth. Woo! On the water squat. Skip! Your dirty moment.